Hi, today I'm going to talk about the process of applying to colleges in the United States. This is a slide with pictures from the largest universities in each state of the United States. So that's 50 of them, but there's hundreds of more universities and colleges all across the United States in every single state. So the first challenge that most students have is just trying to figure out where to get started. How can I start to figure out which college I should apply to? How can I build a list of colleges? Um, so the first place I tell students to start is go to the College Board website. And this is where you will sign up to take SATs and SAT subject tests. But the site also has a huge amount of information about U.S. universities and what kinds of topics you can study at those universities, how large the universities are, where they're located, all kinds of things. They have a useful search function uh, on the website and you can put in that you're interested in studying hotel management and veterinary medicine or that kind of thing. And you can see all of the schools in the United States that offer those studies and then you can put other things that you want a school that's large or a school that's small and you can start to see what kinds of schools will fit what you're looking for in a university. If you're applying to university in the United States you will use the common application. The common application now is used by probably more than 600 schools in the United States and all of the most prestigious schools except for MIT um, use the common application. Many state schools don't, so if you apply to say the University of California, you'll be using the University of California application. But most students from Japan will be using the common application and then possibly one or two other ones. The common application is convenient because you fill out all of your information once within the application and it goes to all of the universities that accept that document. The parts of the application are an essay and there you'll have five choices of, of essay topics to, to write about. It's a 650 word essay and you can find the topics on the Common Application website now. Um, there are, there will be two letters of recommendation that teachers from your school should write. I usually recommend that students have teachers who they've had in the past year or two who teach them core classes like English or Japanese history or science teachers, those kinds of math teachers, that kind of thing. There will also be a school report that is usually written by a counselor at your school, perhaps for Japanese students it might be your homeroom teacher who will write the school report and along with the school report will go your transcript which lists all of the classes you've taken during high school as well as your grades in those classes. Um, there will also be a chance for you on your common application to list all of your extracurricular activities, the things that you've done both within your school and outside of your school. 